As a student at ESCO, you have access to an accessibility tool known as UJA Panorama. UJA Panorama helps you increase the accessibility of your course materials, and you can also use the UJA Panorama web extension to make any website accessible. To download the extension, on the home screen of Brightspace, choose the UJA Panorama link. You will come to your user settings page. Here you can select your preferred language and enable the display icons. You will then have to go to user setup and follow the instructions on this page. So first, click here to install the Panorama browser extension. You can then choose add to Chrome for the extension. Select Add Extension, and the extension will download. If you are using Microsoft Edge, you will have to get the extension slightly differently. You will have the option to get the extension at the top of the page rather than using the Get down at the bottom. So choose Get Extension, and then choose Add Extension, and this will download it for Microsoft Edge. Once you've downloaded the extension, it will be available under the puzzle icon for your extensions. Select the puzzle icon and choose the UJA Panorama for Digital Accessibility icon and choose to pin it. This will keep it on your web browser bar. We then need to go back to our UJA tab and we now need to do instruction number two and choose to connect our extension. Once we have successfully activated the extension, we can now use it on any website. Here we have the Digital Futures Toolkit. I'm going to choose the UJ extension. And I'm going to turn on the Website Accessibility Tool. Once I click off the page, I'll notice that this little accessibility icon has turned up select it, I will get access to the UJA accessibility profiles. So for example, I can turn on the ADHD profile, which will give me focused lines so that I can focus on the specific information that I need to read. If I need to change the profile, I can open up the ADHD profile and I can adjust the settings. I can also turn off the profile and set my own preferences, of color adjustments and content adjustments. So I can change the size of the font, the style of the font, how spaced out things are, where it's aligned and add reading masks as well. Once I'm happy with a profile, I can choose Save. This will keep the profile available for me on this website. 